My name is Olivia and I'm a type 1 diabetic. I enjoy gymnastics and singing, playing the ukulele, and I just really love to exercise and get out. I love to play the ukulele. I started having these symptoms, I started losing a lot of weight, and I just got really sick, and it was really upsetting because I didn't know what was going on, and no one else did, and I was, people thought that I just stopped eating, but in reality, I was eating a lot, and I was just losing weight no matter what, and I went into the hospital, and they put me in the ICU, and everything just happened so fast, and it was like one second, I was this perfectly normal, healthy kid, and then the next, they're giving me a diagnosis for something I'm going to have for the rest of my life. I wake up, and I have to check my blood sugar, give myself a shot, same thing at lunch and dinner, and then at night, I have to give myself one or two shots. And when I get high or low, it really like messes with me, especially when I get low and I feel like I'm gonna pass out. It's, it's like not easy on me. It like makes me feel like I can't breathe. I'm like shaking. I, like my legs like just collapse under them. And then if I'm high, it's, I'm so tired. I don't wanna get up or move around or do anything like that. And it can be really difficult on me. I feel like I can't do as many things as my friends can anymore and they just, they treat me differently sometimes and it's hard, but they try to support me as much as they can. I was scared. I didn't know what camp was gonna be like. It was weird leaving home for three weeks and but I was also like excited. It actually changed my life and I'm not just saying that, it really did. It made me, it helped me manage myself. It helped me make friends who can relate to me. The best thing is the people. The people make everything. And if I didn't meet some of those people that I met there, like I made a bunch of best friends there that I still talk to today. And we just got through everything together. Whenever something happened, we knew it was normal and we didn't like give each other weird looks. We just, we had fun with everything. Lydia is my mentor and she's just awesome. Every time I was going through something hard at camp or I had a trouble, she would take me out to the side and talk to me and she would build me back up. And she's the most amazing person I met at that camp. She's wonderful, I love her. <laughs> it's brought a lot of blessings to me. It made me, have a deeper connection with music and a deeper connection with myself because I learned a lot more about myself after I got it and I learned I learned a lot and it made me more responsible and I got to meet some amazing people that I would have never met if I didn't get this disease. My name's Olivia and I'm Sweeney Strong.